Hi guys, it's Sylvia. I'm here to show you how to make this propagation station. It's a very cute decoration for your home and it actually helps you organize the propagations that you have going on. I usually have mine all around the apartment in random containers and that always bothered me. So this makes it really fun because you can have them organized in one area. If you want to learn how to make it, please go ahead and watch the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Thank you so much. See you next time. So the materials that we need is a stick, some twine, some glass bottles. I got these at the Dollar Tree. They came in a pack of five. These are super cute. And I also have some moss here. I have glue sticks, a glue gun, some crystals, a few decorations. I have seashells. I also got those at the dollar stores. So I'm not sure which ones I will be using yet. Now we're gonna cut a piece of twine. This will depend how long you want your station to hang. Because with this, we're going to tie our stick. We're going to tie each corner. Make sure that your knots end upwards. I forgot, you also need some scissors. Once you have both ends with your knots, now you're going to grab the excess rope and you're going to wrap it around, like this. Now we're going to grab a long piece of twine to be able to tie our little bottles. This will depend how long you want them and how much space you want in between them. It's better for your twine to be too long than too short. That way you can work with it better. You're gonna go ahead and tie your little bottles this way. You're gonna make a knot and tie it very, very good. Now you're gonna go ahead and glue that little piece of excess rope right there. All the way around. Okay, now I'm gonna add little bottle number two. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna make sure I leave enough space. And once I have my knot really secure, I'm going to go ahead and glue a little bit of the rope around my bottle. And once I glue that around my bottle, I'm going to make sure I end in the same area where I made my knot. I'm going to do this with all of my bottles. You can add as many as you want to each line. You can make them as long or as short as you like. It doesn't even have to be multiple. Even one string looks super cute.
Okay, so now I have my stick and I will add the lines with my bottles to my stick. I will tie them and I will do the same thing that I did before. Once I make my knot and secure it really well, I will go around the stick with the extra rope and the glue. You can go ahead and lift your station, that way you can see if it's the desired length that you want. You can do that as you go, before you glue everything down, that way you make sure it's looking how you want it to look. Fabulous. Okay, so I'm done attaching all of my little bottles. Now it's time for my most favorite part ever, which is decorating. So let's go ahead and do that now. Okay, now I'm gonna add a little glue in the center. You can put it wherever you want. You can even do it on the little bottles. You can do it anywhere. I just think it's going to look good on the stick. So I'm going to put right there a crystal, well, some moss first. I like to put a bunch of moss and then take the excess off later. That way I can cover all of the areas of the glue. So I'm going to put moss everywhere I want to. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and glue some seashells and a few crystals. You can arrange them anywhere you want to. You don't even have to put the same things. You can do anything you like. Okay, so I am done with my propagation station. I'm so happy with it. I am totally in love, totally obsessed. If you have any friends that love plants as much as I do, please share with them because I'm sure they're going to love this. <laughs> 